family i am here for a quick time not a long time let's make this boy quick so first thing first make sure you guys are over on our twitter page t sports debate make sure you are following over here this is when we're watching the games i can give you guys updates of what's going on actively we can rant cry and complain yesterday we had another one in day so in hockey we went six and a one is i'm not mad at six and one the reason being if you guys watch any hockey you've seen the pittsburgh game they started off four they started off down four to zero and I thought it was over with, then they scored one goal, then two goals, then three goals, then four, went to overtime and won it. So since we got lucky on this one, they got us back on this one. This was a race to two goals. No team got to two goals. They finished, they ended the regular regulation zero to zero. <laughs> did overtime, did a shootout, and they lost one, you know, so that was sucky. But we ended up making profits. We lost on a prize picks. Jalen Green hit by one point, one assist, one rebound, one whatever you want to call it. And what else we did? Letter. We won the letter challenge. We now have $80 good stuff. We get to pocket 30 of it. This is what we own today. Let's show you. But before we do, we are on day three we are one in percentage of in march is undefeated we haven't had a losing day in march so far the first seven days of the month if you bet the way i show you you have not lost any money and you know my goal is to stay over a 70 percent winning percentage and it looks like we are doing that by far so that's that's good that's good so first let's start with the letter letter we are doing seven legs today we're doing evan mobley and bam 10 points mobley and bam 10 points we doing a kd four rebounds devin booker four assists and kd two assists and last we have pg 13 15 points Kawhi four rebounds once again these are three same game parlays. Mobley and Bam, 10 points. KD, four rebounds, two assists. Booker, four assists. Paul George, 15 points. Kawhi, four rebounds. $50 gets you over 100 by the end of the day. We shall be in a three <laughs> in a in a three figures. <laughs> in three figures, baby. That's the go. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. If you guys are not in the Patreon, you come to the Patreon, you get access to early bets. You get to talk to me personally on what bets you should be doing and other perks and giveaway. Um, who needs to message me back? Because we gave away $40. I paid somebody $20. We're waiting for the other person to respond and give me their information. So if you haven't did that already, send me your info so I can give you some money. All right. Now, this is the money line. You don't have to do this as parlays because we know we'll never fully go undefeated we always miss one or something so you have the Atlanta Hawks to win straight up I got them straight up we'll talk about in a second um we got Portland Trail Blazers alternate spread plus 15 and a half I did this on on draft not draft well, yeah draft kings then we have Denver to cover the spread win by eight eight points and last, we have the Clippers to win straight up. Good odds on every single one of these. These all hit. It'd be some good money. Last, price picks. We are switching it up today. We have more than three picks. We got six. We did the maximum. $20 win you 500 and all of them hit. First, we got Ice Trey. To finally get out of his slump, he's no longer in Miami. I don't know what thing he had out there. He wasn't playing right. So we need over points with good old Ice Trey. Rebounds. Literally been rebounding crazy against my Pistons. He grabbed every rebound he could see. So I believe he's going to keep that same intensity and get a bunch of rebounds early. So over five rebounds. Al Horford, we going over three assists. 
Jason Tatum. We doing over three turnovers, switching it up over three turnovers. Westbrook, less than five rebounds. His role with the Clippers changed. Like Lakers, he'd get a bunch of rebounds. Clippers, that's not his role. So he got over five one time since he's been there. Every time besides that, it's been five or less. And Devin Booker points over. We about to have some fun. Let's hit all of them. Let's get $500. $20 bet. Let's try it. And if we get four, we still go in the green. So at least need 40s out of the six to hit. Now, I'm covering all games. You have Hawks versus Wizards. I like the Hawks straight up. You don't have to grab no spread. Wizards on a back-to-back. They struggled against the Pistons last night, but end up pulling out last second one by like two. This is a good one. You got Celtics versus the Blazers. Excuse me. Oh, I'm tired. Celtics is a lot better than the Blazers. But if you do an alternate spread, they already they already, already get them expected to get, to get blown out. Whenever you got Dame Dollar, we don't know. He might could score 70 points. We have no idea. But I'm taking advantage of that. 15 and a half. They lose by 15. We still win. So we just need them to be up early and Celtics come back and win probably. Cavs versus Heat. I have no idea who's going to win this game. So I'm leaving that alone. When you don't have no idea, you just pick the home team. Mavericks versus Pelicans. Mavericks is on a back-to-back. -back. I left everybody on player props alone with Mavericks because they're not at home. Playing back-to-back. And the Pelicans are not a bad team. So I have no idea. We'll leave that alone. Denver. Denver blew them out last time they played them in Chicago. So I can see a never blowout in home. At home, I was able to get spread at eight, nine. Uh, I, I, I would say 7.5 to eight um, is worth it. But never know. Should be a blowout. Suns now SGA them. They just won a good one against the Warriors last night. Back to back, but all of them is young, so back to back really don't affect them. They're just excited to play a top team, and they're not too far away from them. They're five games away, so expect them to play hard. Suns still should win this game. Clippers, I got Clippers beating the Raptors. I see you could take the spread, but I just took them straight up we'll see how that go only got three games in nhl i didn't give any bets it's simple wings been playing terrible they are like on a five game losing streak i will take blackhawks to beat the wings with an upset great odds wings just haven't been able to score any goals or they will score early and come back and lose so love you wings but i will pick the upset on that one this one, I have no idea who's going to win it because the Wild is on a back-to-back. -back. They played yesterday, and they couldn't score one goal. But Jets, they... Ah, man, they, they didn't lost to... Um, they they 0-2 against um, Minnesota. They're 0-2. They haven't scored... They can't score against um, Minnesota for some reason. So I will stay away from this. You see, first game they played, scored one goal. Second game they played, scored one goal. I don't know. I have no idea what would happen that game, so I will leave that one alone. And this is an easy one. I will take Vancouver to win straight up because Ducks played yesterday back-to-back. -back. This um should be an easy one. So those are two I will probably take. You know, you can figure it out from there. If you guys are not subscribed, make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Subscribe to the Sports Debate. Interest in the Patreon. Make sure you guys get signed up. Welcome you on into the family. Become a Hall of Famer. Talk to y'all soon.